in many of our earlier modules, we spent a lot of time talking about heterogeneous treatment effects. The idea that your unit level causal effect is different from someone else's unit level causal effect. And so we have to define parameters like the average treatment effect, the average treatment on the treated, the local average treatment effect, and so on. So what about in panel data? What do we learn? Which one of these numbers can we learn from our data using panel data ideas? Well, actually, the methodological research on this question is still pretty young, and it's also quite technical. So we're going to skip most of it. But there is some intuition I want you to take away. Remember back to the very beginning when we're talking about randomized experiments. We have to have variation in the treatment if we want to learn about treatment effects. So think about panel data. Suppose that we have data on a bunch of people at two different points in time, and at each point in time we observe their outcome and their treatment status, whether they're treated or not. Suppose that in our data set nobody was treated in both points in time. Then clearly we wouldn't be able to learn about any treatment effects because nobody's treated ever at any point in time. So how on earth would we construct the counterfactual of what their outcomes would have been if they were treated. The same thing is true if in our data everybody was treated at both points in time. We would not be able to learn about causal effects. So this suggests that one thing that's important in panel data are switchers, people who change their treatment status over time. Now it turns out that when we have heterogeneous treatment effects, we're only going to be able to learn the average treatment effects for the switchers, for people whose treatment status are changing over time. Now that's actually very similar to the local average treatment effect idea. There, we showed that we could only learn the average treatment effect for compliers. These are people who complied with their treatment assignment. So we could not learn the average treatment effect for people who never took treatment or people who always took treatment. Those are kind of like non-switchers, people who no matter what their treatment assignment is, they do the same thing. In the panel data setting, a non-switcher is somebody who e who's either always treated or never treated. So it's very similar to an always taker or never taker, and therefore we're also not going to be able to learn effects for them. So in general, we won't be able to learn the overall average treatment effect. We're only going to be able to get it for the switchers when we're looking at panel data.